Take a stroll down Clayton Street in downtown Athens and you'll find it difficult not to notice the gigantic menagerie of vegetables and garden animals that decorates the side of the last resort bar and grill. When you're driving by, you can't help you know, but, but look at it and go, wow, look at that unbelievable mural. It's one of the best murals I've ever seen. The Last Resort mural is one of many symbols of the business's commitment to the arts. Another mural and several paintings decorate the inside of the establishment as well. With these, the restaurant doubles as an art gallery for local artists. Well, from day one, we had artists show their artwork, uh, rotates every month, and we give 100% of the proceedings to the artists. It all started back in the 70s when The Last Resort was a music club and a daily host to local musicians, supporting the arts through music. Was, uh, my mother was a musician, and I would go and see my mother perform there on the stage where the, where the grill is now. When Clegg reopened the resort as a bar and grill in 92, she decided to continue supporting Athens artists in another way. Like the mural, these paintings were completed by local artists, but why choose to do something like this? Because it allows us every month to sort of change our face and be, be dynamic. So as a business, it's, it's really helpful to us and then it also allows us to, you know, to support people in the community. The mural itself was painted by Athens native David Jenkins, who says that he would like to see a lot more of them around. I would really like to see this not become the Athens landmark. I'd like to see him be more, I'd like to see somebody outdo me. Jenkins believes that more outdoor artwork could have a positive impact on Athens businesses more public art done in Athens. I, I think it would really help Athens a lot. And, it, and it, it, Athens deserves it. Brittany Lai, Grady News Source.